Welcome back to Base Watches, your ultimate destination for all things timepiece related. Today, we're on a mission to uncover the top 5 watches under $1,000 for men that you can still snag in 2024. Whether you're a seasoned watch enthusiast or just starting your collection, finding the perfect balance between quality and affordability is key. So, if you're ready to discover the best bang for your buck in the world of watches, stick around as we showcase the top contenders for 2024. Let's dive in and find your next wristwatch companion. The Tudor FXD almost certainly has a few ingredients you think you will like, but this watch is a great example of why you trust the chef. That doesn't mean it's perfect or Michelin star worthy. It means that some questionable or otherwise unusual traits have been turned into something genuinely and surprisingly good. The FXD measures 42mm in diameter from the edges of the bezel assembly, however, if you take the measurement from the case itself, you're looking at 41mm. The lug-to-lug -lug is where the real concern was laid, which is advertised as being 52mm. In reality, the measurement taken from the center of the lug bars is 51.4mm. It's important to note that those lug bars bow out and away from the case, and if you take the measurement from the tips of the lugs, you'll get 49.7mm. Finally, total thickness is 12.7 mm, about 1.5 mm thinner than the existing Pelagos. Tudor is using their MT5602 automatic movement within the FXD, which we've seen put to use in dateless black bays since its introduction back in 2015. As the dial attests, this is a chronometer, officially certified, and in my time with the watch it remained within a second each day. The movement offers 70 hours of reserve and gets a silicon balance spring which is non-magnetic. The Tudor FXD is an odd mix of components that somehow come together to work way better than they have any business doing. From the case to the dial to the bezel, there's nothing straightforward about this watch, but it manages to be much more than the sum of those parts. There are a handful of watch designs that are instantly and unmistakably recognizable from across a room. If a watch brand is lucky enough to have one of these, then a lot of the hard work is already done. The Panerai Luminar is without question one of these designs. In many ways, the Panerai Luminar Marina 44mm PAM1313 is a return to basics for the brand. It's a no-frills out-and-out tool watch. The 44mm case features the classic lines of Panerai's Luminar 1950 case with a matte brushed finish and a polished bezel. It features 24mm lugs and Panerai's quick-release strap chain system. Water resistance is a very fitting 300 meters, thanks to a solid screw-down case back. The PAM1313 has a quality in-house automatic movement with a more than ample three days of power reserve. If you've been tempted by the slimmer luminar do, but have had difficulty accepting its lower depth rating, this could be a good watch to check out. It brings the refined aesthetic that helped define the do to the table, though not the thinness. This guy is a full 15.65mm thick while staying true to what many think a Panerai ought to be. As I said, this is a return to basics for Panerai. A number of wristies were upset when Panerai introduced the Caliber P9010 and updated longtime favorites, such as the Luminar Marina Pan 312 and Pan 359 to include some controversial changes like Blue Seconds Hand and vastly reduced water resistance ratings. This Luminar Marina Pan 1313 isn't perfect, but it goes some way in righting those wrongs. A watch should make you smile. It should put a little spring in your step. And for the lucky few, it might just do both as you find yourself glancing down at it throughout the day. But it's a rare instance. The Omega Speedmaster 50th Anniversary Silver Snoopy Edition is the third in a whimsical trio of limited edition Speedmasters that have each paid homage to a quirky NASA award, each time yielding highly collectible, but markedly different outcome. Rich blue hues aside, it's a dramatic shift in tone from the cute, but arguably much more sedate, execution of 2015's Apollo 13 anniversary silver Snoopy LE, which depicted a luminous silhouette of Snoopy literally asleep at the 9 o'clock register. It's funny just how much Snoopy's own physical depiction completely changes the vibe of the watch, but here we've got very deep relief of Charles Schulz's famous beagle in his signature dance, arms and ears akimbo, grinning ear to ear from within the confines of a space helmet. It's the official illustration used for the physical sterling silver Snoopy medallion awarded to NASA employees and its contractors for outstanding achievements related to human flight safety or mission success, and a detail we've come to expect reserved for the caseback of Speedmaster Snoopy editions. 
And speaking of casebacks, the addition of the modules and an exhibition glass through which to view them render this watch a hair thicker than the standard Speedmaster Saphir sandwich. Measuring 15.5 mm thick at the top of the slightly domed Saphir crystal, this 42 mm silver Snoopy adds an imperceptible 1.5 mm to the aforementioned, which feels like a fair concession to make for the watch's undeniable charm. Otherwise, its presence on the wrist is entirely predictable for those familiar with the Speedmaster's long-running silhouette. The Hamilton Intramatic Auto Chrono Panda is a watch that has garnered significant attention and positive reviews for its stunning design, vintage-inspired aesthetics, and reliable performance. The term Panda refers to the specific dial configuration of the Intramatic Auto Chrono, where the subdials are white or light-colored, while the main dial is black, resembling the appearance of a panda's face. This dial design has a classic and timeless appeal, evoking the vintage chromographs from the mid-20th century. The watch features a stainless steel case, typically around 40 mm in diameter, with clean lines and a polished finish, exuding a sense of understated elegance. The dial of the Intramatic Auto Chrono Panda is often praised for its legibility and balanced layout. The contrasting subdials enhance the watch's readability, while the white accents on the chronograph hands add a sporty touch. Inside the watch beats a reliable and precise automatic movement, ensuring accurate timekeeping and smooth chronograph functions. The Sapphire Crystal provides excellent protection against scratches and adds to the watch's overall durability. The Intramatic Auto Chrono Panda usually comes with a comfortable leather strap, completing its vintage look and adding to its charm. Overall, the Hamilton Intramatic Auto Chrono Panda is a well-received timepiece that captures the essence of vintage chronographs while offering modern reliability and quality. Its classic design and versatile appeal make it an excellent choice for both watch enthusiasts and those seeking stylish and sophisticated timepieces for various occasions. The Tag Hoya Aquarasur 300 is one of the newest versions of the Aquarasur lineup and like previous variations through the years, there are changes. Still, it's not a totally revamped model. Most would consider this a positive as if something works. Let's not mess with it too much. The case of the Aquarasur 300M measures about 43mm, which provides enough presence on the wrist, especially underwater. It comes in two material options, versatile stainless steel and lightweight titanium. Confident and versatile, the Aquarasur 300M's overall design is expressive of the brand's sports legacy. Dials are usually rendered in high-contrast hues such as silver, black, or blue for maximum legibility, but Tag Hoyo also threw in a bright orange, pink, and green, which lend a playful twist. In addition to the classic Time and Date Aquarasur, the new collection also features a GMT model. Time and Date watches run on the in-house automatic caliber 5, which offers a balance frequency rating of 28,000. 800 vibrations per hour and a 38-hour power reserve. The Aquarasur 300 straddles the line between elegance and professionalism and is a pure symbol of Tag Hoya adventurous spirit. If you guys like this video or this video helped you, please give the video a like. Links to all the products mentioned are in the description below. If you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Till next time, I will see you guys later.